up and out of here with that flame. Every day we lit, yeah. Every day we lit, yeah. Good morning, Legit Nation, guys. Good morning, I hope everybody's having a very amazing day this morning. My name's Tim, and if you guys are not following me on social media, follow me down below, and if you are not a part of the Legit Nation, hit that subscribe button and join the nation. Let's get started with today's video, because it's gonna be epic. <sighs> Honey, I'm home. Right now, guys, we are all getting all packed up because we got our trip to Dallas. Texas, once again, guys, like I said, guys, Kickspo, if you're not there or if you didn't go because the video is probably going to be uploaded afterwards, you should have went because it was a banging event. But, yo, we got the Tommy bag that we thrifted right here, and then we got the Aldo bag for all the tech gear for my backpack. So, dude, it's going to be a lit event, man. My friends are coming over. We're all going. It's going to be dope today. So, I mean, I'm, 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 I'm looking forward to it, okay? I'm sorry, I get too hyped for the vlog. So we ended up taking my parents' vehicle because we're gonna go to Dallas and we needed a vehicle big enough. We're out here picking up my boy JP right now. We're supposed to leave here at six and it's already seven. No, we're supposed to leave here at five. It's already seven, fi 17. My boy got a haircut, look at him. Fam, we're late because of you. What do you mean? Because we would have been out by now, no, dude. Bro, that's because we got tired of, this guy got a haircut too, man. He only comes out in the flea market videos though. Boy didn't even get a fresh cut though, man. For real, like I should have went at least, but these dudes get a fresh cut and I didn't even. Anyways, let's just cut to a cinematic. We're gonna be on the road in three, two, one. Guys, and we just got to San Marcos, man, with you know, the homies Jose and JP. Um, Beth and the other girls went shopping somewhere else, but today we made a quick stop at the Nike outlet just because um, we're on this road trip, right? And I know you guys wanted to see some fire flame for the day, so I had to come through at the outlet real quick, and uh, we're gonna see what they have in here. So let's check it out. Boom, Nike. You guys already know, man. It's gonna be lit. It's, today. Lit. it's, it's gonna be lit. fire. Every day we lit. Every day we lit. Yeah. Nike. Here we go once again. Look, best first day ever. What? Oh, the sign. Dude, this Jordan shirt is dope. I like it. What do y'all think of this shirt? Yo. It's pretty dope. dope. What shoes is he wearing? Uh, Dang, the sixes. sixes. He's wearing those sixes. Liddy. So they got the same shirt, but in black. This is more Liddy. Fire fits. Fire fits. I might cop the white one, honestly. I'm trying to get. Dude, the hair. Dude, this is tight. I like this one. I'm trying to cop something. Jordan 7 hairs. I like I like this one. It looks pretty fresh, honestly. To me, it looks fresh, but all right. So the clothing's dope and all, but we gotta go to the kicks, man. We gotta go check out the shoes. Air Jordans. Ooh, they made it. One fifty for the fours. Dang, I can't believe we found this. Like I can't believe the fours are in here. That's honestly pretty clean. Right? Retails one ninety. They're in here for one fifty. That's not bad. What are they called? Champagnes. Those what? are the um champ. Uh, the uh. Bleh. The All Star Weekend Sixes. There you go. I knew what they're called. I was gonna 150. cop these. Dude, these are pretty fresh, so I might cop them here. Man, I wanted these. Right. I'm gonna have to try them on. I don't know, bro. We'll see. Bunch of Jordans. You know, you know. Some. Some Air Force One highs. I'll cop some of these Air Force Ones. Don't I don't know, know look at that. that. Let's look in the bins, though. They usually have some fire in the bins. Bro. You want some Cortez? Cortez is on the come up. Just saying. You think so? I think these so, though. I you like these? I think they're they're kind of fresh. I like the little. Snakes. I don't know. I don't know Cortez yet. I don't know if I rock Cortez, but I mean, shout out to those who wear them, because I mean, they're cool, but look, the th these didn't sell at all. I have these. Yeah. I knew these would be at the outlets. They're like Prestos. 150. Prestos? I want to Now, those are fresh. Yeah, you need some Prestos. LeBron 13 Lowe's, $100. 150 normally. Dude, this is like size. What size is it? I like those, though. Those are kind of like the breads. They're like they the bread. Right. Yeah, like, like the bread colorway. They reminded me of the Bread 11s when they first went to the mall. LeBron James. Hey, right now Kyrie's trying to go to the Spurs. He's leaving LeBron. Dang, bro. That'd be tight. If Kyrie went Imagine to the Spurs, Kyrie I would buy every Spurs. single Kyrie. Yeah. Honestly, if Kyrie, if Kyrie went to the Spurs. Some KD 9s in here. This is what, Oreo uh, colorway. This is what um, uh, Ginobili plays in. He oh, plays in exact shoes. He KD, the Oreos? For a hundred dollars, Ginobili or shoes are here at the outlets, bro. Yo, these look pretty fresh, honestly. They look like an Adidas Nike. Thirty-five dollars, bro. Look, an Adidas Nike. 
What? What do you mean? It looks like an Adidas it shoe. It kind of looks low key like. It looks like a like a Yeezy pure boost. Colorway. Or no, no, no. Where they like the Maybe. tubulars? Yeah, the tubulars. yeah. yeah. Bro, these what look. Are these? I those are the KDs. newest KDs. Yeah, they're the oh, newest they are KDs. KDs. Yeah. Honestly, See, it says the, KD on the back. No, the flat net looks kind of trash on it. I don't know. This look. I don't like the color. I, don't know. I like the way the laces look. I like the design. They got some of these Nike dunks in here. Pretty cool. A lot of colorways. Yo, soccer yeah. cleats. Jose, what soccer cleats are those, bro? Give us a lesson. All right, bro. Right here, we got the Hyper Venom Phantom 3. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Dull, bro. Fresh, bro. Uh, honestly, How much is retail? Steel, bro. Retail's retail, 250 We got them right These here for 60, 70 bucks 70 right dollars, here. dude. Steals that is deals. insane, bro. For all you uh, soccer fans hey, would out you there. Wear those? Would you wear those? Yeah, I probably would, bro. Dude, $250 out, for, honestly, for $70? Bro, you'll stick all out right, on the field, bro. People will be What's able to look at you. What's your favorite soccer team? What's your yeah, soccer team? Bro. Come on, shout it out. Shout it out. Say it. All right, shout out to Rayado Monterrey. What's hey. up? Hey. Yeah. All right, but though, dude, these this is a steal, guys. Like, honestly, I need to start looking at cleats more because, like, this is a steal big time. Horachi's down there. Where? Down there, Horachi's. Oh, bro, I've been sleeping on Horachi's. I remember yeah, sleeping all on them when they first dropped. Like, I like the, those gold aglets at the end. Bro, when I was in high school, in my senior year, these were oh, yeah, hot. Cool. Everybody yeah, was bro. rocking Hirachis. Yeah, Hirachis were like the new Roshis for a little they bit, were. honestly. I'm a 10 and a half. Like, I, I like them, but I don't love them. Like, I'm going to try on a 10 and a half, though, real quick. I'm going to go try on 10 and a half. Dude, real quick, before we try these on, these are crazy, though. These are like some weird print. Damn, six, six, Air Max, bucks. 65 bucks. But, I don't know, man. It's more of like a... It's like an Aztec print. It's like a Native man. American winter shoe. All right, guys, we got these fours right here. I'm about to try them on. Um, the only fours I have in my collection right now are those uh, royalty fours, the gold and black ones. But um, I used to have the fire red fours once, and I had the Toros to begin with. That was my first Jordan ever, so I used to really like the fours. Um, I don't know, bro. I mean, they're pretty clean. I like them. I rock gold. them right now, honestly. I like them. They look good on you. I rock them right now. Honestly, I didn't like the way they look, but on feet they look better. I feel like Jordan kind of cheapened the laces, though, honestly. Like with the new upcoming, yeah. Does it look good with this fit, though? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, show, talk about this. All right, right here we got the Mercurial Vapor 11s. Shout out to Cristiano Ronaldo. Damn, bro, bro Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Heck yeah, bro, these are dope. And look, retail $225, 100 bucks. Steals and deals. Freaking steal. Bro, are you serious? $225, yeah, bro? bro? Yo, there's a Cristiano Ronaldo, Ronaldo, Ronaldo food. Cristiano Ronaldo? Bro, I might have to cop up here, honestly. Yeah, I love Cristiano Ronaldo, bro. Damn. Yeah. Damn. High piece? High piece. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Soccer high piece coming through. Soccer high piece. <laughs> Kyrie 3 N7s. N7s. N7s are always lit, but it says no back stock available. How much are they though? How much are these Kyries? They're the price on the box. Okay. Because What's the, they're Oh, they're 20. retail. Okay, they're 120. Well, they're N7. Right, which right. Is the collection that we donate money to the Native oh, okay. Americans. Oh, okay. You donate Virginia's? Donate money to the Native Americans. Got yes. it. Okay. Cool, so cool. So, they're special edition. They come out twice a year. They twice a year, a right, year. right. One. Wow. Right Sock darts and sevens? Yeah. Oh wow. Those that are that's cool. sweet. Actually, yeah, that's pretty cool. Them, this is the Hirachi. The Hirachi and seven, yeah. right, got you. And they have a clothing, wow. they have clothing as well. That's awesome. Yeah. Soon to be new Spurs member? Please. Soon to be please, please come Kyrie. Spurs. Come to the Spurs. Come to, Spurs, come to the Spurs, Kyrie. Nice. They're nice, right? Yeah, I like them. They're kinda like the fire red fours. Yeah. It's the blue, right? <laughs> oh yeah, the motor store. Sorry, the motor store. There you go. Uh, all right, cool. All right, cool, man. Thank you, bro. You have a good one. All right, you too. Hopping out of here with that flame. Yo, walking out of the Nike outlet, man. You guys know your boy uh, cops some heat already. You already know, man. Fire. It's been uh, it's been dope, Nike. Thank you so much for the fire again. We didn't expect to find anything, fire but flame fire flame heat in the tags. <laughs> so we found some Jordans, man, and um. Yeah, you guys know that's how it is. My boy caught the shirt. Lady. So we're gonna continue on this road to Dallas, and uh, hopefully we'll be there soon. So uh, let's just let's just jump to our next destination. Ready? One, two, three. Hey. All right, guys. So now, before we leave the outlets, we are here at we the Adidas store. Adidas store. We so had to. Gonna kick us out. I honestly hate this store because they kick me out every time I come here. But we'll see what happens. It, they just remodeled it, so yeah. I told you there's nothing good here, bro. So far, nothing. So far, nothing. No boost. Jose, any good cleats? Mm, not sure. Not sure yet. All right, not enough time. Oh, these are kind of cool, but they're kind of lame too. Forty dollars. Thirty-nine dollars for those. It's not bad. I told you it would be dry. They never have any boost or anything. Nothing. Just Dan Smith. 
Oh, I tripped over that. Yeah, the only good stuff they have is in the girls section, pretty much. This is a boost. I don't know what the hell is this. Like. Pretty much all they have, the good stuff, is in the girls section. The guys never has anything at all. I told them, I tried to warn them that this store had nothing, but they wanted to come, so I told them no, but they were like, yeah, let's go, let's go. So one thing of Here's some Ultra Boost guys. for girls. Other than that, it's dry. Excuse me, do y'all sell Yeezys here? No. No? Okay. Uh, she was kind of rude to me, though. She was kind of rude. She didn't want to say anything. Yeah, that girl was kind of rude to me right what there. Did she say? I don't know. She just didn't say anything. I asked her. Not asked her. Okay, sorry. All right, guys, we can't record in here because she's being rude, so she doesn't want it on camera. So that girl was so rude, man. Like I just tried to see if there was easy, and she would just like swerve, like don't talk to me at all. And I was like, what? I was like, why is that girl being rude to me? Like I just asked for Yeezys. That's it. That's all I asked. That's what you asked for? I asked for Yeezys and she just acted rude. So I was like, whatever yeah. then, man. Gosh. What happened, bro? My bro, they low key, they low key kicked us out right now. Bro. They were like, "Yo, can y'all not record in here?" I was like, "Oh, you're being rude." And she was being rude to me. Are you serious? Yeah, I was like, "Do I have Yeezys?" And she was just like, "I was like, really?" I was like, "Why? Like, why are you being rude?" And then she's like, "Can y'all not film?" So we're about to dip right now to Dallas. You ready? Yeah. Let's just jump to the next location. Ready? <laughs> Three, two, one. Guys, we just got to Dallas, Texas, man. We're about to check into the room. I'm pretty excited. It's gonna be an amazing experience this weekend, guys. And I'm just excited for you know the whole experience, seeing the city, everything with my boys. We're about to go in the room. Let's check it out. 17th floor. 17th floor, my dudes. It's haunted. What happened? Are you sure that was the right one? Are you sure it's the right one? You're not walking in somebody's room. Boom, we out here, baby. Da oh, oh, what's wrong with this light, bro? Dallas, Texas. We, dude, I can't wait to see this view though. Dallas, Texas, we out here. We just got to the room right now. Downtown Dallas, baby. Do not open it. So we're looking for this pool, but it closed at midnight. And we got, what time do we get here? Like 12.30. Like 12.30, right? So we got here like 30 minutes late because my boy got a fresh cut though. That's all that matters is his fresh cut. Because your boy's hair is looking dumb and, but I'm just going to wear a hat. It's all good. All right, let's see this pool though. Let's see it anyways. Where is it? I feel like it's over there. I f what if a scary clown pops up? Then I could use it for clickbait. Creepy clown in my hallway. <gasps> Dude, it says 11. Oh, quiet time. You gotta be quiet. Yeah, wait. Yo. This is the pool right here. It's pretty sexy, honestly. Bro, why are you doing that? You can just open it like this. <laughs> yeah. You gotta get that cinematic right here. Bro, I didn't even get, I didn't even get to to get a snapchat though because my phone was dead so that honestly pretty much sucks but check out this view though wow my dude out here making noise in dallas dude check out that the monitor rail Yo, it's pretty nice up here though, honestly. It's really, really nice up here, guys. Like, I'm really liking it. Check out that dog photo shot on the iPhone. What are you doing, bro? You're gonna get us all kicked out. You're gonna get us all kicked out. Bro, get off that. My boy's, my boy's about to get us all kicked out, and I'm gonna be so mad. But yo, check out that long green building. All right, so right now we're gonna go get something to eat right now. We honestly don't know this city too much, but I'm excited to explore it. We're gonna go see what they have to eat. What do you feel like eating right now? Anything. Anything, honestly. I want some tacos, but we're not in San Antonio. I don't know how they do. I think they call them burritos here. I think they call them breakfast burritos. We're still in Texas though. Yeah, but they call them burritos in Dallas. Are you sure? Yeah. Workout center, baby. We came through to the workout center. I think we're gonna get a workout tonight. Cause you know that's how your boy does it, man. Legit nation. Let's go. Let's go, go baby. Let's go. Right here. Right here. Hey, hey, hey. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. Yeah. What happened? Hey, bro. That baby looking at us, bro. Right through the window. Are you serious? Where is she? She took off. She took off. She was just like she was just straight up staring at us, bro. Damn. You can hear you hear from like the elevator. Are you serious? Yeah. All right, we got too hyped. Honestly, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry about that. All the way down, dude. Turn that heat all the way up. Turn it all the way up. 
Let's go. Now, dude, turn it all the way up, bro. It's gonna get hot in here. Let's go. We need that heat. 90 degrees. 90. Let's go. Completed, guys. Yeah. My boys are beasts. Let's go, beast squad. Let's get it. Now we're gonna get a Coca Cola. Sorry. <laughs> All right, guys. We're literally hours away from having to wake up for tomorrow for the event. We gotta go to sleep because we got a really busy day tomorrow. So I'm gonna go ahead and close up this vlog here. Right quick before we wrap up though guys, today's word of the day comes from Matthew 6, 19 through 21. It says, do not lay up for yourselves treasures on earth where moth and rust destroy and where thieves break in and steal. But lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven where neither moth nor rust destroys and where thieves do not break in and steal. For where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Now this verse, basically what it means is that a lot of times we strive for glory, riches, and everything on earth. We want to be the best on earth. But we got to remember that this earth is only temporary we are going into a, a new basically we're going into somewhere else guys like this is not permanent we're going into a new life once we die and once we go into heaven with Christ so instead of you know wanting it to be all about us 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 all the time buying stuff and buying riches and stuff instead we should work on our treasures in heaven now what does it mean to work on treasures in heaven basically um, helping the poor Doing stuff for uh, ministerial purposes, spreading God's word, all that will help you uh, store your treasure up in heaven instead of on earth. And yeah, it might not be all about us on earth, but those things will help us when we go to heaven, guys. So it's not all about, you know, what we have here on earth because in, in the end, guys, it says the last will be first and the first will be last, guys. So keep that in mind. And uh, other than that, guys... I hope that you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are praying. I hope you guys are reading your word. And until tomorrow, guys, I'm going to go ahead and close up this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy that, please bless me with a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button to join the Legit Nation. And until tomorrow, guys, we will see you guys in the next video. Peace, homies. Stay blessed. We're out of here.